In this video, we'll go through exam questions that cover the criteria read time from analog and 24 hour digital clocks in hours and minutes. You can locate the questions on the massmass.com website under entry 3. The questions come from different exam boards. We'll start with the non calculated questions and then we'll move to the calculated questions. Here's the first question This clock shows the time the cafe opens in the morning. What time does the clock show? So the shorthand tells us the hours. So that's just past seven, but not eight yet. So it's seven, five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five. So it's seven twenty-five in the morning. So that is AM. Or we could write it as 0725. That's the 24 hour format, which means the same time. What time does the clock show? So again, shorthand tells us the hours. It's just past four. So we're going to say four, five, 10, 15, 20. We know this is in the evening, so we're going to write PM. At a charity fundraise event, four friends finished the race in the following times. Friend A, 1 hour 12 minutes. Friend B, 54 minutes. Friend C, 1 hour 6 minutes. Friend D, 57 minutes. Who had the fastest time? Tick one. Friend A and friend C, they took over one hour, so they're not the fastest. So we're going to focus on friend B and friend D. Friend B took 54 minutes and friend D took 57 minutes. 54 is smaller than 57, so we're going to tick friend B because they have done the race in the shortest time. Jaden is dancing in a show. This is a timetable for the show. Order of activities, time taken. Group dances, 25 minutes. Break, 10 minutes. Solo dances, 20 minutes. Award presentation, 15 minutes. The show starts at 7 p.m. Jaden's dance will be the first solo dance. What time will his dance start? Show your calculations below. So the show starts at 7 p.m. So that's the point here. And then we have the group dances, which take 25 minutes. So we're going to 7.25 p.m. And then we have a break. For 10 minutes so we're going to 7 35 p.m. so we add in 10 to 25 then we have the solo dances so Jaden's is the first one so that will be at 7 35 p.m. Now we move into calculated questions. Mina and her friends need to leave soon to catch the bus to the cinema. Mina looks at the time now. What time is it? So starting with the hours shorthand, that is at two. And then we look at the minutes. So that is five, 10, 15, 20. We don't know whether this is in the morning or the afternoon, so we're just going to leave it as 2.20. Claire gets to the check-in desk at this time. What time does the clock show? So looking at the shorthand, that is after 4, but it's not at 5 yet. So that's why we're going to say 4 
and minutes, we got 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40. So it's 440. Carly gets to the park at 11.50 a.m. The walk in the park takes 40 minutes. Carly wants to finish the walk by 12.25 p.m. Does she have enough time to finish the walk? Give a reason for your answer. So Carly gets to the park at 11.50 a.m. We need to add 40 minutes to that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to add 10 minutes first because that's what we need to get to 12 p.m. because there are 60 minutes in an hour. So if I add 10 minutes, this will take us to 12 p.m. So I've done 10 minutes here. I now need to add another 30 because 10 and 30 gives us 40 minutes. So if I add 30 minutes now, this becomes 12.30 p.m. Carly wants to finish the walk by 12.25 p.m. Does she have enough time to finish the walk? No, because this is five minutes later. Carly gets to the dog groom salon at this time in the morning. Which digital clock shows this time? So the time is 9 5 10 15 20 21 22 23 This is in the morning, so it will be 0923 in 24 hour format or 923 a.m. in 12 hour format. So we've got to match that with one of the answers. So we've got option A, which is the correct one. Option B, that's in the evening. Option C, that's sometime in the afternoon. 4.45 p.m. and then we've got option D which is about 11 p.m. so the only correct option is option A. Rachel and her son get to the festival at 20 minutes to 5 in the afternoon. Which clock shows this time? Tick your answer. 20 minutes to 5 that means that it needs 20 minutes to get to 5 o'clock. So it is 4.40 p.m. Because there are 60 minutes in one hour, so 60 take away 20 gives us 40. The options that we have here, they're all in 24-hour format. So we're going to change this to 16.40. Because 4 add 12 gives us 16. So we add 12 when we convert to 24 hour format. And the time is in the afternoon or evening. So 1640, that's option C. The arrivals board at an airport shows when planes are expected to land. A man goes to the airport to meet his friend from a flight from New York. He checks his friend's flight arrival. The man checks the time on his watch. How long will the man have to wait for the flight to arrive? So the time shown on the watch is 6, 5, 10, 15, 20, 
so it's 6.20 and the flight is expected at 20.50. So I'm going to convert this to 24 hour format. So 12 and 6, that is 18, 18, 20. So 20, 50. Take away 18, 20. 50 take away 20 gives us 30. 20 take away 18 gives us 2. So it's 2 hours and 30 minutes. A customer called Mr. Brown phoned to order a chair this morning. This clock shows the time he phoned. So that is 10, 20. AM as it's in the morning. Mr. Brown says he will collect the chair from the store in two and a half hours. Write a note in the box to say when Mr. Brown will collect the chair. So, two and a half hours added to 10.20 a.m. So, 10.20, if we add one hour, that will be 11.20. If we add another hour, that will be 12.20. If we add 30 minutes, which is half an hour, that will be 12. 20 and 30 gives us 50. So that is 12.50. It's after midday, so this is p.m. This is the end of the questions.